there's something quite kind of magical about Figaro Mountain Brewery. Welcome to the Fig family. What brought me here was great beer. What kept me coming back was the fantastic people. I don't know what they do, but somehow they must uh, instill a very, very uh, important thing to all of the employees, and that is to be outstandingly friendly to everyone, and they are. It's, it's basically giving the customer what, a, a little bit more than what they expect. You know, I spend a lot of time in the tap room, I have done in the past, you know, and uh, formed lifelong friendship with a lot of the customers here. Fig family is exactly that. I mean, it's a collective family. Uh, we're all kind of from different places, but uh, we come together with Figueroa. Everybody is um, part of our Figueroa Mountain family. Um, as a customer, as an employee, we are Figueroa Mountain. Once you're in the Fig family, you're in the Fig family, and so whatever it takes, whatever you need. If you need help building a fence, we'll show up and build a damn fence. You know, like that's kind of how we are. It's a lifelong bond you have here. You know somebody's going to be there to back you up when you need it, no matter what situation you're in. We love each other. We literally love each other. He's one of my best friends that I know, and he works with me. It definitely is a family. Um, Jim and Jamie being the, you know, the father figures of the company. But um, it really does feel like a family when you're, you're working for this company. Um, every voice is heard, every opinion counts. Um, so, you know, we communicate well together and uh, it feels like a tight-knit group. When we started, it was just something that kind of happened organically. Um, just great people who just really genuinely like each other. So it's something that's lucky. Um, it wasn't, I don't think it was planned, but um, it's something that definitely can't be replicated. Everybody has fun, positive vibes. It's never a dull moment at all. Um, we're all such good friends and we hang out outside of work as well, so really it's just like a family. There's nowhere else I'd rather be. If I were to eat anything, they're there for me, so I mean, um, this company really is a blessing to work for and um, they really do treat you well here. The owners actually embracing everyone that comes in here as part of their almost immediate family. I mean, they're, they're a pretty close-knit group by themselves, but anybody that they bring in, they bring in with open arms. Almost every day a customer becomes part of the Fig family. It happens quickly, actually, yeah. You can come in here three nights in a row, and all of a sudden you know the owner, and you know how this place works, and you know the brewer, and it's all, it's all local. Figaro Mountain Brewing Company wouldn't exist, uh, wouldn't grow, and wouldn't succeed without every single individual contributing, from the cellarmen, to the serving staff, to the brewmasters, to the office staff, to uh, people out there, you know, peddling and out in the field, we wouldn't succeed. And it's to those individuals that we owe everything to. What sets our beer apart from anyone else is the quality of the product. You know, we're not here to move beer, okay? That's the end result. The end result is you move beer because your beer is good. So the beer is high end, top quality. If someone grabs one of our beers, gets it off the shelf, gets a six pack, takes it home, number one looks at the branding and says, wow, this is incredible. These guys put this much attention into what this, what the label looks like. I really wonder what's inside, okay? Then they crack it, they taste it. Nice, crisp, fresh. California to, to the T, West Coast to the T. So once they get through the bottle, they realize that, hey, you know what, this isn't just a fleeting moment. This is a really good beer. They're gonna go back and get another one. Again, it goes back to the quality aspect. And I think from start to finish, from every aspect of our business, from every employee that is ingrained in them, that quality is never sacrificed. 
presentation and communication to the end consumer is not sacrificed because you can make a great product and there's a lot of them out there. But if you don't educate the consumer or if you aren't able to communicate to them or make them feel a part of what you do, then I think you're falling short of the bigger picture of what beer is. I mean, beer is a social liquid. Beer is something that you can um, describe how it's made. It's a, it's a craft product. But there's love that goes into that. There's people who care and worry about every inch of the floor that's scrubbed so there's not bacteria involved. There's people that worry that it always stays in cold storage traveling from our place out to an account. Um, they're worrying about how the beer is poured and whether or not there's a proper amount of head in the glass. And that type of OCD, ADD, stress ball environment that we might have created is something that I think is a big differentiator for us, that we really care how you think. <laughs> they serve good beer. Yeah! <laughs>